time. The gamma of Towa Kagilanai uh, is meaning that it's not necessarily so or it's not always true. And when you use the gamma of Towa Kagilanai, that means you can use uh, with the verb now, na adjective, and e adjective, as you see here. But what you have to be uh, careful about when you use the grammar of Towa Kagiranai, that means when you use the verb, you should change the verb to be the casual form. And when you use the now, after the now, you should follow by da, and after that, follow by Towa Kagiranai. And when you use the na HD, it's just uh, like the same as uh, of using about now, right? That means after the na HD, you also have to follow by the da, and after that, follow by towa kagila nai. When you use the EHD, you don't need to change anything, you just use in that way, and after that, follow by towa kagila nai. And some, sometimes uh, the towa kagilana is uh, you can use uh, in the same like towa uh, kagilimasen is uh, have the same meaning. So when you use uh, with the towa kagilana is have the meaning that not necessary so or is not always true something like this. So the next. Uh, Let's go to see some example to make more understand about how to use the grammar of Towa Kagilanai. In here, our first example, they say, Sensei no kotai ga itsumo tarashi to wa kagilimasen. Sensei no kotai ga itsumo tarashi to wa kagilimasen. Which means in English like this, the teacher's answers are not always correct. The teacher's answers are not always correct. This means that uh, in here, what we have to uh, learn about is they say towa kagilimasen. Towa kagilimasen is just the same meaning like towa kagila nai. Kagilanai is uh, not so polite. Kagilimasen is uh, more than pol is uh, more polite than the kagilanai, right? So it just has the same meaning and it's just in the uh, negative form, the same. And in this sentence, uh, what we have to learn about is uh, you should focus uh, about before the towa in here. They use the EHD, right? In here, our EHD is Tarashi, is in EHD, right? EHD, that means you don't need to change anything after the EHD, that means you just do in that form. So, as you see here, they just write Tarashi and followed by Towa Kagilimasen. It's more Tarashi Towa Kagilimasen, which means that. It's not always true or it's not always correct, right? Sensei no kotai ga itsumo to wa kagirimasen, which means the teacher's answer is not always correct or it's not always true, right? Sometimes it's not true, it's not correct because teacher is also helmet. So helmet is, uh, can make the mistake for some time. So let's see the next example. Koyu ongaku wa dare demo suki da to wa kagiranai. Koyu ongaku wa dare demo suki da to wa kagiranai. Which means that this sort of music is not necessarily liked by everyone. This sort 
of new seeds is not necessary like by Elivan. In this sentence, they say Towa Kagiramai. So, what we should pay attention about is the, what is the word they use in this uh, sentence. In here, they say Suki. Suki is mean the na estate, right? So, after the na estate, you should follow by da, and after that, you follow by Towa Kagiramai. This means that Suki da towa kakiranai. So when you use with the nudge tip, you should follow by da and after that towa kakiranai. And you see here. And in this and then, uh, it had a meaning that not necessary, right? So koyu onkaku wa dale demo suki da towa kakiranai, right? This means this, this kind of music or this sort of music. It's not necessary like by everyone, which means that some song is uh, maybe you like, but another body don't like, right? So even you like, it's not mean that everybody like. So in Japanese, in a case like this, you can say kagila nai. This means it's out of the uh, limitation. So somebody like, but somebody don't like. So you can say suki da. Dale de Mosquita Towa Kagila Nai. Even almost 90% uh, of the people like, but 10% don't like. Right. So let's see the next example. Okane Mochi ni naleba kanalazu shiawa se ni nare towa kagili ma sen. Okane Mochi ni naleba kanalazu shiawa se ni nare towa kagili ma sen. Which means that becoming rich doesn't ne necessarily make you happy. Becoming rich doesn't ne necessarily make you happy. In here, we see that uh, they use the verb right in here. And in here, our verb is not, it's in the casual form. And after the verb, they follow by towa kagilimasen. Kagilimasen and kagilanai is just the same, but in the knife form and mass form, right? The mass form is uh, more polite than the knife form, so you can use kagilimasen. So in this sentence, they say. Shiawase, kanala shiawase, ni naru to wa kagirimasen. That means, uh, even you are the rich man, but it doesn't mean that everybody to be the rich man is happy, have the happiness. It's not right. That, that means, um, even somebody you have the, you have uh, many money and you be the rich man in the country. But you still have many problems and make you are not happy like the normal people. So that means uh, it's not necessary for everybody to be, uh, every rich man to be happy when you get rich. The next example is Iidagaku o sotsugyo shita kara. いい会社に入れるとは限らない。いい大学を卒業したからいい会社に入れるとは限らない。Which means that just because you graduate from a good university doesn't mean you will be able to get into a good company. Just because you graduate from a good university doesn't mean you will be able to get into a good company. In this sentence, you see that they use um, the verb with the toba kagi lanai. In here, our verb is highlighted. Highlighted is uh, mean uh, you can enter to the 
you can work or you can enter to the uh, good company that means you can work in a good company or that means you can get a job in a good company and here is mean in the uh, dictionary form right high level is mean in the dictionary form and after that verb there followed by towa kagirana is mean that you don't need to change anything if you use the verb with towa kagirana and the meaning of this sentence is mean that even you graduate from the uh, good university or the famous university but it doesn't mean that you can get a job from a, a great company like google facebook or something or general electric right so even you graduate from the famous university but it doesn't mean that everybody can get a job from the great company a big company the famous company